Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy. I take you out, guy. Here with another video. This video is for the Google Now uh, 2016 full review. What we're going to talk about, we're going to talk about everything Google Now from the Google Now launcher to the Google Now cards to the OK Google. See? And that's, that's the thing I'm going to get into, okay? A lot of people don't like this Google Now launcher because it has the Google search bar on every home screen or every screen you, you swipe to. And they say it gets in the way of customization, customizing the home screen. Look, man, look, maybe you need a bigger screen size phone or something like that. I, I don't know. But Google has the right idea because you want you want Google there for you. You know what I'm saying? Google, is, Google now is your assistant. Okay, Google is your assistant. See? You know, it, it, it knows I'm talking. So <laughs> it, it's your assistant whenever you need it. So it's, it's there, okay? And, uh, yeah. This is the Google App Launcher, uh, the Google uh, Google Now Launcher, and this is the Google App Drawer. My bad. Um, you have your four uh, most used apps at the top, and then right here you can scroll down, alphabet equal order, or alphabet order, and you know you can find your apps more easy, and they'll pop up beginning of each letter. And not only that, but you can also Hold this down to search. So you can search instantly, quick, right from your home screen. You don't even actually have to open up the app drawer. But that's something there. Now, once I swipe this way, you have the Google Now cards. Now, in order to turn this on, you have to go through the settings. Okay? And you have to go to Now cards. And then you have to make sure you want show cards with Android 6.0 and up. You have Now on tap, which provides base. Um, current inf information on the screen when holding the home screen button um, searching and you can search with um, voice that way too um, not only that but you can turn on notifications and then you can um, also um, let it notify you um, on which cards you want like weather commute sports story places you name it all right so that's how the Google Now cards uh, work and based on how you set it up that's exactly how it's going to show it's going to show See, I like sports. I like hockey too. See, I got the Blues versus Predators. Got Blackhawks, uh, college basketball, Indiana versus uh, Michigan, NBA. Uh, it just showed Chicago and Miami um, scores and things like that. And not not only that. Let me let me go ahead and uh, get in some to you real quick. Give you some information about this Miami Heat Hawks game. All right. So it'll, it'll give you that information. Let's 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 take a deep uh, look into it. All right. So. It even show you what game they just played, what games they got coming up for the rest of the week and the rest of the way. Um, news, highlights, you can even get highlights. So let's go to the news. The news about Miami Heat, uh, what, what's coming up next, um, you know, uh, who's hurt, who's not, uh, who had an outstanding game. Standings, where are they ranked? They're ranked um, number four right now, Cavaliers number one. So Chicago number three. Okay, so... You, you have that. You have that information at your fingertips, all right? Not only that, but hear me out. Hear me out. For the weather, and, and this is something new. This is something new if you guys haven't paid attention. Hopefully, your Google Now uh, launcher, Google app has updated. But with the weather, check out check out this animation, guys. Check it out. Not only that, let's, let's take a deep, deeper look into it. Check that out. Now, this is all in Google Now. This is all in Google Now, Google app. Google now launches you. You can all add this um, to your device. It's gonna, it's gonna give you um, I, look tomorrow. This is what's gonna look like tomorrow. Rainy thunderstorm, East St. Louis. Um, high 64 degrees, low 37. Uh, and then it gives you hour by hour of what's supposed to happen, how, uh, what the percentage chances of it raining, storming. Not only that, uh, the low, the UV index, chance of rain, sunset, sunrise. And it's and then you get a ten day forecast. Check that out. So, it, Google is stepping the game up. To pretty pretty soon, you won't even need to download all them apps. Not only that, it gives you app information. I got Feedly, so it's gonna give me like top news stories. So Google, once again, it's a top news story today because Alphabet is the most worth um most worthy company right now with five hundred eighteen billion dollars. It's even out beating Apple, and I got a notification on Facebook. So, 
let, let, let's go in there. Let's take a look, a deeper look into this uh, article, okay? And see, and, and you can get the article instantly. Depending on what application you have, it can send you right there. Not only that, you can tweet. You can tweet about it. Let's tweet. Let's tweet about it. So we're going to tweet. Boom. We, we tweet the article out, notification out. Not only that, but this is another neat feature. Okay, you see I got a little information, right? Google now on tap. Let me move that out the way. Google now on tap. You hold that down. You get a screenshot of information of what's going on in Feedly. So, it's giving me information about Eric Schmidt. He's he's a software engineer at Google. Um, Steve Jobs, RP. Um, Alphabet Inc., the main company now, and Google's under Alphabet. So, you get news. You can um, see tweets about Eric Schmidt. You can see tweets about Steve Jobs. Um, check them out on Google Plus, YouTube. I mean, it's it's it's, it's limitless to Google Now and Google Now on Tap and Google Now Cards, Google Now Launcher. Like I said, guys, um, and not only that, with the Google Now Launcher, you have landscape mode now. You can rotate. So I have this Nexus 6. And it feels like a tablet. And I know a lot of people are like, your phone is freaking huge, dude. You got a big phone. Like, why do you need a big phone? But, hey, at least I don't need a 7-inch tablet anymore. So now I have the advantage uh, of having a phone and a tablet in one. Not only that, but Google Now Launcher, it, 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 makes, it makes it more easier to use. So I can just turn it sideways if I can't reach an app. Hey, this is my tablet. This is my, my phone. So... And that's why it's called a fabric. All right. So, yeah, guys, this is my full review. I hope I was more informative. Oh, one more thing, guys. One more thing. The OK Google stuff. It gives you more information. You can ask it crazy questions. And all right, let's say you want to do something. OK, Google. Roll a dice. And it's going to roll a dice for me. Two. I got a two. Now let's say something else. Okay, Google. Hold on. Okay, Google. My fault, y'all. Okay, Google. Flip a coin. That boom. It's gonna flip a coin, and then went tail. So there you have it. I mean, it's it's pretty much limitless to Google Now, Google Now Launcher, the Google Now Cards. Everything is integrated. Everything just works. And like I said, you, you can't go wrong with this, guys. This is a slick design. You got material design on Android. That's the new um, base thing Google's going. That's the new formula Google's going with. Great animation. Can't go wrong. It just works. End of the discussion. Check out the full review. Check out the article in the description. If you don't want to watch it, you want to read about it, there you go. Hopefully, I was helpful and informative. Please leave comments. If you don't understand anything, you want to know more about Google Now and Google Now Launcher and the Google Now Cards, do that. Share this video. Like it. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Holler at your boy.